this week's ASFA News Flash. Remember, if you would like to take part in the ASFA News Flash, simply submit your catch to mycatch at ASFN.co.za. That is mycatch at ASFN.co.za. Also remember that ASFN supports responsible and sustainable angling. Let's get right into this week's catches. Our first catch is from Clint Lowe who caught a spectacular PB of 7.8 kilograms. This beautiful Sienbrus measured in at 85 centimeters. This was caught on fresh bloodworm using a 2-0 Trinidad circle hook, 50 pound braid, a 14 foot assassin and a Zors Z80. Louis managed to catch a 245 centimeter female bronze whaler shark. This took him 45 minutes, 250 minutes to land and he wasn't even using a bucket. Congratulations on this catch. And then unfortunately the next angler did not submit his details and his name but he caught this beautiful white steenbrus. This was caught on an assassin, bluefish and a cirrus 8000. This fish was safely released. Matthew Blair managed to catch a couple of cob in Durban Harbour. He used his Dawa Ninja 4000 and 15 pound braid. A rose with a 110 centimeter gray shark. This is 19 kilograms and it was a female shark. This fish he caught at Addington Beach in Durban. The next catch is from a young lady, Leah June Chetty, who caught this three spot pompana and this was at Amatikuru Beach on the north coast of Kwazulu Natal. Brian Chetty with three beautiful diamond rays that were caught on mackerel bait. This was also at Amatikulu beach on the north coast of Kuzuru Natal. Then another catch that was submitted looks like a Java shark. Unfortunately the details weren't supplied and this was caught on his Dawa Saltus at Buyeni. Basil Chetty with a black tip on Bonito that was caught on his Grand Wave SL50 and a 14 foot Perglas rod. He also managed to catch a brown skate at Matikuru using Bonito, a sand shark on a mackerel mix bait and then a diamond ray on a bonito and mackerel combo. The diamond ray was caught on his Dawa Beachy. Walt Westhuizen with some smooth hound shark catches at the Crom River. He used his sustained 10,000 and his assassin bluefish rod with 30 pound braid and this was caught on old yellowtail bait. Tian Furi with a 1.2 meter gray shark. This was caught on his Akuma Azort slim surf rod. Then young Ryan Stubbs of only seven years old caught this 10 kilogram barbel at the Vol River. This fish measured in at 102 centimeters. Tian and Carl Frick were their personal best yellowtail catches. This was yellowtail of 4.5 kilograms and another one of 5 kilograms. This was done trawling with Rapalas using a Big Boss 6000 30 pound braid and an adrenaline LTB 6 foot rod. Brent with an eel of 85 centimeters caught at Durban Harbour. This fish was safely released. He used his Akuma Revenger 12 foot, his Akuma Revenger RVPX 55, 80 pound boss braid and a mackerel and chocker combo bait covered with a sheeta skirt. Stephen Kovacs with a 73 centimeter spotted grunter that he called at Swatkops River. This fish was safely released. John Jacobs with a 1.87 meter ragged tooth shark. This was a male fish and he used his pen slammer 10,500 and a BKK 12 o hook. Devan Jacobs, his brother with a female racket tooth shark of 2 meters using his Berkeley Venom Medusa, his pen slammer 10,500 and a 14 o Trinidad hook. Then a familiar face on eyes of N Samara Ibrahim who caught this beautiful yellowfin tuna of 73 kilograms. And this was off the boat Monish. It shows you that small bottles can pack a big punch. This fish was caught at the canyon off Hotby. Mark Pillay with a female grey shark at Durban Beach caught on his Shimano XH and his Torium 30. Rainy with a black muscle cracker and a smooth hound shark. Then Yaka Ferreira shared his beautiful eagle ray with us. Marco Pretoria sent in a number of catches that he caught over the past couple of weeks. First was a racket of shark of 164 kilograms on yellowtail head that was droned out. The second one, a racket of shark of 136 kilograms. This was on yellowtail cast bait. Then another racket of shark of 86 kilograms, also on yellowtail cast bait. Then he managed to hook into a diamond ray of 52 kilograms, and this was on a mackerel cast bait. These fish were caught at St. Francis using his Makara blue 
15 foot and a BG Max Seal 8000 with 50 pound braid. Then a spectacular catch for Mikhail van Rooyen. A male Zambezi shark of 181 kilograms. This is 209 centimeters. This fish took 3 hours and 13 minutes to land and this was at Blue Water Bay. Let's have a look at this spectacular specimen of a fish. Hey guys, Blackerman. Run for over two hours and yeah, it's flipping an awesome, awesome experience he's having here. Yeah? You're doing well, buddy. Yeah? You're doing well. You got him. That's it. Show him. Show him you. You the boss, not him. Today you win the fight, not him. That's it. Buddy, handle it a bit, handle it a bit. Well done, buddy, eh? Well done. Yesterday, awesome catch. Zambezi. We're taking the measurement now. Taking the measurement. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. That's it, buddy. Then he also managed to catch a grey shark of 13 kilograms. That is 97 centimeters. And this was also at Blue Water Bay. We thank you for watching and remember to keep those catches coming to mycatch at asfin.co.za. That is mycatch at asfin.co.za. Guys, and also please remember to include the name of the angler, who caught the fish, where it was caught, and what it was caught. And that just helps all the anglers around us to improve our fishing results. And guys, please remember that ASFN supports responsible and sustainable angling so let's look after our resources let's look after our environment and remember to join us next week same place same time have a great weekend <laughs>